What is up, view of people? My name is Tara Lunsford, and welcome back to another Magic Trick Review here on the channel. Now, if you're new here, then definitely please consider subscribing and take a look around the channel on my past review. But if you're not, then you probably are already subscribed, and I greatly appreciate that. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this review of Hydra right now. First off, you need to know what actually is Hydra. With Hydra, now your spectator can legitimately search for anything on Google using their own phone, and you can have it appear in your Instagram bio or Facebook timeline. If you own Wikitest, then you can add an extra prediction by predicting the word that they thought of in your Instagram bio. And now that you know what Hydra is and what you'll be receiving, let's talk about some more questions you may have, such as how difficult is it to perform? Hydra is not that difficult to do at all. Practically, the app does all the work for you, so you're really not going to need to do a whole lot of work here. Once you initially get this set up, you get everything connected, then you're going to be able to go out and perform this app because everything that is happening is not sleight of hand. It's all with this app. And you just got to make sure that you got everything connected the right way, which you can do initially, and it won't take too long, maybe about initially 15 to 20 minutes to set up once you've watched the tutorial videos. It's not hard to do, but it will just take a little, little bit of time. How are the angles for Hydra? The angles for Hydra are great depending on what routine you're doing and even on the ones where the angles are a little bit less than great, they're still good. What I mean by that is that if you're using like an external app such as Inject or Wikitest, you can get your angles to be a little bit better because you don't have to input anything on your phone during the routine. But if you're using the, you know, just kind of like, you're gonna pick this number and then you need to make sure that you get that number that they say or thinking of inputted into the phone. I hope I'm not saying too much there. I mean, you obviously know it needs to get inputted, but you need to do that on your phone without them seeing, which that's built into the routine with some misdirection you can get around, but just know that you can't have anybody behind you overlooking you like on your shoulders looking at your phone. So you need people like 360, if you wanna do it 360, you're gonna need people to be using like Inject or Wikitest or have an accomplice that you've loaded up your Inject ID on their phone, stuff like that. So you can get around it, but I just wanna throw that out there. You can make your angles either good or great. It really just depends on which routine you're doing. Is Hydra examinable? Yes, it is, because this is your real Instagram account that they can even open up on their phone and they will see the whatever you predicted in your bio or on Facebook or whatnot. That's on their phone. That's not an app that you're using that, you know, oh, this is a fake Instagram. No, that is real Instagram. That is real Facebook. That could be on their phone, your phone. It does not matter, but those are real apps. So yes, they can be examined. Is there any DIY? The DIY that you have to do is just basically setting up the app initially. That's all the work you have to do is just connect your accounts through this app. Make sure you like get everything logged in using the correct IDs and everything. That's all the work you have to do. It does not take that long and it's really just a one-time setup thing that you have to do. So you're not have to do it again once you get it done the first time. And I will say, if you want to do the version with Inject or Wikitest, then you're going to need to buy a little bit of stuff. You're going to need to buy the expansion pack, which it's not that expensive at all. And I highly, highly recommend it. It is worth it. You're going to want to get it because it just makes it so you can be a lot more hands off with it and predict a lot more. So I highly recommend buying the expansion pack. Are there any negatives when it comes to using Hydra? Well, yes and no. The negatives kind of go away when you buy the expansion pack, when you buy this way to use inject and wiki test my my negatives are really just that you have to look at your phone and input something during the routine when it it could be a lot more hands-off and a lot more free if you're using something else like inject or like wiki test that's when i think that this effect is really just at its true potential so i highly recommend that you buy the expansion pack not me selling i mean i'm this was i'm not getting any money from this i'm genuinely just saying you're going to want to get this because the expansion pack just adds so many more opportunities and possibilities makes it look a lot more clean and my negatives of having to input something really go away when you get that expansion pack one of the positives about hydra the positives are that this is something that you can use and it just looks really clean. It's a really clean prediction. And if you get this, you're definitely gonna use it because it's something you always have on you if you have your phone. And if you have Inject, or if you have Wikitest, then you're gonna wanna input this stuff, make it look really clean, it's gonna look awesome. It's gonna be on their phone, their Instagram, like whenever you open up, whenever they open up their Instagram and go to your profile, it truly is their Instagram. It's not an app, it's just the authentic Instagram app, which I love about it. And I think that just makes it such a clean looking prediction and that's what I really like about it. What should this retail as? Well, currently Hydra is gonna set you back about 40 US dollars plus $10 for the expansion pack to use inject and wiki test integrations. So I'm gonna say it costs about $50 because you're definitely gonna to wanna to get the expansion pack. I think that $40 could be a little bit overpriced because you don't have the wiki test plus inject features. But when you add in that $10 fee and you get up to $50, then the inject and wiki test stuff, 
I think that then it becomes worth the money. I honestly think the in integration part of it could have even went for more because I just believe it adds so much more value and so much more impact on the effect itself. So maybe that's magician talk, but I do just think it looks a lot more clean, a lot more free. You can be a lot more, kind of have a lot more possibilities with what you're having your spectators choose and all that kind of stuff. So I do think that once you add in the stuff and it costs $50, I think then it's worth the money. But $40 just to do the basic stuff, I think it might be slightly overpriced. Probably should be more like $30 and then the expansion pack should be more like 20. But yeah, I'd say $50 in total. I think it's a fair price. Thank you so much for watching this video all the way to the end. I really do appreciate it. If you feel that Hydra is for you, I will leave a link to purchase it in the description down below. Also, I'd like to thank Shamir Salim for allowing me to have this product so that way I can just review a few of people out there. Also, Shamir just released, just released a new app, so if you want to go check that out, I'll put a link for that in the description as well because I do love Shamir and I think that the stuff he puts out is really cool and I just want to be able to showcase more of his magic because the stuff that he's put out recently has been really good. I think Hydra is probably his best release in my opinion. I think there's just a lot to do with it. I think there's a lot of possibilities. So with all that said, thanks so much for watching. I really hope you have a wonderful rest of your week whenever you're watching this. Maybe you're watching it at the beginning or the end. Does not matter. I hope you have a great day, great week, and I will see you in my next video that I post on the channel sometime soon. Remember, be nice to people. See ya. But I highly, highly recommend. Yeah.